Hello guys, this is second update on the game I've been working on. And uh, what you're seeing is the uh, third sector of the first zone. Oh yeah, people uh, actually uh, requested for me to show the uh, rest of the zone. I'm not going to show you the second and the third zone today, but I will show you the third sector of the first zone. This is actually, a, as you can see, it's an Evernight Forest, the zone name of the name, and the zone name of the zone. It's temporary right now. As you can see, it's uh, totally dark. It's uh, it, there's no sunlight or anything. I actually toned up the uh, intensity, uh, the sunlight intensity, and the fog a bit, so you can see stuff clearly rather than uh, actually you no know, feeling like you're in the nighttime or anything. Yeah, this is the actual uh, zone. I'm not gonna show you the whole zone today. But uh, what I'm about to show you is the new functionality. I actually worked uh, for the past two days, as you can see there. That's the uh, the quest hub. It's going to be the lights, but I'm not going to go in there yet. Let's go to uh, the NPCs, where I'll show you the uh, new functionality I actually worked on. I finished quest manager, like the whole thing with the rewards and all that and including the tooltip manager as you can see if I hover over this NPC right there it shows the name and his profession and his current health and if, if he's a friendly character it shows uh, his profession as a uh, green font color and uh, as you can see if I uh, hover over an enemy there it shows as red and you can also if you didn't watch my uh, previous videos these supposed to be potions and if you hover over them as you can see it's a traditional tooltip for an item and you also can notice that when you hover over an item it highlights before I didn't have that functionality as you can see yep they will highlight there you go it shows the sell price buyout price and use what you get and all that and my back hanging and just uh, pick them up. There we go. And in the backpack, it also shows uh, the tooltip. There we go. Okay, what uh, I'm about to show you is the uh, reward system. Just a quick update. As you can see, the quest manager is actually uh, implemented a little bit, and it looks really, really better than last time. As you can see, it has a title there. And yep, that NPC turned blue. It's actually a bug. I didn't figure that out yet. Please forgive me for that. I have no idea what that bug is. I figured it out yesterday and I uh, still didn't look into it yet. But it will be fixed later. Okay, uh, back to the uh, original content. And there's a title for the quest. As you can see, it's a, it's a bold letter. And if you scroll down, it says the objective and the rewards. And if you hover over the rewards, it doesn't show you the tooltip. I did not work on it yet, but I will update them later. As you can see, it says, okay, you'll get 100 gold and potions and you know, mana potion. All you gotta do is talk to his friend. Let's go talk to you. If you remember from the from my last video, you gotta talk to these two people. There we go. Oh yeah, and you might, I totally forgot about that. There's a chat window. It's uh, serving as a log. Now it shows, like, you know, if you accept a quest and if the step is completed and the objective, as you can see, the objective has been met. So you can turn the quest in. And you can also do some cool things too. You can type. And today I didn't have my friend with me too, so I'm not going to show you the multiplayer functionality of the game again. And you can type stuff like, hello, guys. And it shows. And no, I didn't turn the quest in. Yeah, there you go. There you go. And if I turn my backpack, I got two health potion and one mana potion. And if I click finish, there you go. It updates. And I got 600 gold right now. And also, I uh, it I changed the uh, store window a little bit, so it looks something like that. It's not perfect, but uh, it serves the purpose for now. As you can see, it also shows the tooltip. You can right click. When is it buy? It's 16 gold, and as you can see, the gold amount is, and also the updates in the, in the logs. 
window. And there you go. It doesn't have a close button yet, but in the future it will. You can scroll through all the uh, all the logs. And the second quest and gives you a mana potion. And my health is really, really low. Last time I had like 1,000 health. There are like uh, lots of uh, mobs there, so I'm just going to get like lots of health potion. So it will just keep me alive. So I killed two of them. There you go. See? So health is going down really, really fast. And I'm uh, using my health potion. And there you go. And two of them die. And he's dead. And I'm running away. And I still have some health potion left. Alright. And yeah, there's a pond right there. I did not put any water effects yet. And there you go. Turn in the quest. Basic mana potion. And I'll get day six, six and thirty thirty-two. So you can see the enemies don't die yet. What I mean by die is they don't disappear after they die. It's uh, as I told you guys earlier, I did not work on the models yet. When I finish all the models, I will work on that. And you will get to see a complete game. Not complete, but you know, things with models. It's not it's no fun. With uh, with you running around with no models around you, right? Yeah, I know. And uh, a little peek, I just decided, you know, since I'm in the zone, I'll just show you the uh, the sector, not the quest hub. Still, still under progress. There you go. It's uh, totally dark. It's forest. There are lots of fog. And this is much better than the first zone. At least that's what I think. And there's some lag. And I have no clue where I'm going right now. Cause there are like four paths, and there's no mini map or anything. Yeah, I'm actually working on that. I will have a mini map n uh, next time, next update probably. And yes, I cannot. Never mind. Because I actually I was having some uh, troubles, uh, you know, pressing the escape key because my keyboard screwed up. And there you go. I don't want to go north because uh, I, I was actually working on a different model right there, and you know, it's just uh, I don't want to you know, spoil the fun for me guys by showing you everything, the cool stuff. Yes, I do have some models in the zone. Uh, for example, there are like statues around the place. But not yet. I'm not going to show you guys anything right now. But uh, just a quick update. And the frame rate is going really, really slow. Yep. I don't really like fraps right now. And that's about it. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Uh, thanks for watching my video.